said unto him, Do all that is in thine heart. Turn thee, behold, I am with thee, according to thy heart. Then said Jonathan, Behold, we will pass over unto these men, and we will discover ourselves unto them. If they say thus unto us, Tarry until we come to you, then we will stand still in our place and will not go up unto them. Man, he said either way it go, the Lord dealing with us. Mm -hmm. If we go up to them, we're going to fucking smash them. If they come up to us, we're going to fucking smash them. Either way it go, the Lord ain't dealing with these people, man. And that's what Jake really got to realize, man. When it come down to these heathens, when it come down to these two-thirds, when it come down to the woman that you love that the Lord don't care about at all, because they two-thirds. Listen, man, the biggest population of the two-thirds are women anyway. It's more Israelite women than men. You really got to understand that the Lord is dealing with you, man. He ain't dealing with these people, man. You know? And these people will never see us in a thing that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Hey, Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai called Abraham a friend of him, man. We the sons of Abraham, man. Lord willing, we joint heirs with Yahweh Shai. These people will never hold us in that esteem. I don't give a damn about them, man. And they don't give a damn about us. The scriptures say that the unjust is an abomination to the just, and the, and the just is an abomination to the unjust, and, and vice versa. You know I'm quoting that Proverbs roughly, but the Lord is really dealing with us, man. If the Lord is with us, who can be against us, man? We don't validate anything these people say, think, or breathe, man. You know, and I was talking to this elder brother the other day, man, and, and we were just going into the... Um, the woman, and uh, we was just going into the uh, the 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 the, the, desire, the undesirables of Israel in general. And when I say Israel, I'm speaking to you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, and even E. You know, their 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 status in this world is is validated off of um, what do people think about them. What makes us special is we don't give a damn about what people think about us. We understand the scriptures. He who is friends with the world is the enemy of the Most High. We don't give a damn about it. Look, man, we bear our cross, man. We put our hands to the plow, man. The Lord is not dealing with these people, man. You got something, brother? Kind, kind. All right, uh, Revelation mm. chapter, chapter uh, 3. And uh, Salah. I'm going to start at verse 7. Mm. And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia write, These things said he that is holy, he that is true, he that hath the key of David, he that openeth and no man shutteth, and shutteth and no man openeth. All right. It's basically, you know, like Brother is saying, you know, we have access, you know, to the knowledge of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, which really catapults you, you know, really above everything. <laughs> you know? Oh. Uh. And uh, speak for a minute, bro. It's another verse I'm going to get for you. Con. Hey, yeah, like the brother said, like the elder brother was saying, that, that, that catapults us about everything, man. You know, when, when Abraham walked, they felt, they felt his spirit, man. When Samson walked, they felt his spirit, man. He slain a thousand men with the jawbone of an ass, man. And he had that power because he knew that the Lord was dealing with him. When Abraham walked, man, even uh, I think his name was Abed Melech, all right, the Pharaoh. You know, at that time, I write to my knowledge, I could be wrong, but he was visited in the dream when Abraham said that, you know, that his wife was his sister. Abraham's vibe was so powerful, <laughs> he was visited with the dream, you know, and the they don't keep the law, statutes, and commandments, he how about Shimei, the Lord spooked him so much for even having a thought that he didn't even think was going off to deal with Abraham's woman, man. He said, I would have, I would have got killed for even considering that, man. Because Abraham was dealing with the Lord, man. King, King David, man. We ain't even got to go under that. For you brothers in the know, yeah. you know how powerful that he was dealing. Look at Joshua and Caleb, man. You got these filthy-ass Hamites that had the whole Israel spook, man. Joshua and Caleb, look, they wearing down there. <laughs> who, are who are those clowns, man? Because they, because they understood the power of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shah dwelling with them. You Jake was spook. Who are these fucking clowns, man? And you got to really be in the spirit of Joshua and Caleb because that was spiritual, man. You had a man from the northern kingdom and a man from the southern kingdom and they was entering in the promised land. Hey, the two sticks are joined back together. 
the, the, the breath of life are, are, are back in the prophets. It's that time, man. It's the second exodus. That's the spirit you got to be in, man. Knowing the Lord is dealing with you, man. 